for curtsy lunges and curtsy step ups, it's really important to understand that this, this puts a lot of stress on the inner knee. Now, this doesn't mean we avoid this exercise. It just means that it comes with time and it comes with caution. So we don't wanna do 100 of these the day after our ACL surgery. We wanna wait until that later half of a program or if you know you're prone to knee injury, this is a great prehab exercise. Now, you're training the strength of all the muscles that hold your knee in positions while going into that valgus force. So again, take it with caution, but don't be afraid. So here's how it goes. You're going to step up onto the step, okay? Then you're going to come off of that step, tapping the toe, and then coming back up onto the step. Again, your knee is going into relative valgus, so a little bit of strain here, but the pain should not be over a three out of 10, okay? It should not be getting worse as you go, it shouldn't feel worse after. It's okay to have a little bit of that stress sensation though. And then what you're going to do is, if that is too much for you, you can take away the step and go into a straight curtsy lunge only. So that, again, reaching behind you, keeping that knee in line with the toe still, but your hip is out, you should feel this hip come into contraction as you lift your leg up to the front. 